Welcome back to the channel. After 16 years of anticipation, Pigeon 3 has finally made its first steps into the world. If you've been in the Linux or open source community for a while, you probably remember Pigeon, the popular multi-protocol instant messaging client that defined communication for many of us back in the day. But why the long wait for version 3? The project faced significant challenges transitioning from GTK2 to GTK3, as well as modernizing its code base to meet today's software standards. The journey wasn't just technical. It was about keeping alive a platform that unites different messaging protocols in one place, even as proprietary platforms like WhatsApp and Slack dominate. So, what's new in Pigeon 3? This early release primarily focuses on a new, modular design. It introduces plugins for better extensibility, laying the groundwork for more features in the future. Additionally, it aims to improve the user interface, making it more modern and accessible. Despite its age and niche status today, Pigeon 3 symbolizes resilience and the spirit of open source innovation. It's a reminder that open source projects, even those that seem dormant, can come back stronger with the right community and determination. If you're curious to try it out, remember, Pigeon 3 is still in the early stages, so expect some rough edges. But it's exciting to see this project finally taking steps into the future. Thanks for watching.